Right, so we're in Beta Mense now. Um, this is much bigger than Alpha Mense, and hopefully it's going to yield a lot of resources. Now we have almost fit. We've almost completely um, like got everything that we need in the ship. So um, let's see. Ah, things are looking disappointing again. This is quite far down, far out to travel to to get disappointing sort of um, resource amounts. Three aluminum, eight aluminum, and two aluminum. You know, when you get that little al aluminium, you call it aluminum. Wow. <laughs> that is not good resources. Right, oh my god. That That is a huge, huge map planet. If all of these are really low in resources, that's going to be so disappointing. Oh, that's not too bad. Metal world. Right. The only problem that I've got with this is that um, soon all of my um, metals are going to be filled up. Oh my god. I'm losing crew like um, a lot of crew. So already this has been a little bit better. Right. I don't seem to be filling up too much at the moment, so... Uh, Okay. The important thing is is that we get a decent amount of RU for this uh, planet. Womp. Right. There we go. Um, I think after Beta Mense we are going to be heading back to Sol. Um, possibly even before we finish this system. Um, because yeah, we're we're getting a lot of um, we're getting a lot of um, resources in. So, a world of absolute nothing. Maybe someone's been there before me. Jeepers creepers. I mean, ideally I want to take as much as I can from these planets, but some of them are just giving me nothing. I mean, this is bad. 14 lithium. You see, these little these little clusters are worth a lot in terms of resources. Mm. Right. That is everything from this. Actually, did I check that red one? My memory is so old, you know. I've got such a bad memory these days. Right. I think I have checked this one, but just... No, I haven't. See? That's the thing. Can't rely on me. Um, there we go. This is a relatively dangerous planet. And uh, I'm not getting a lot of resources from it. Probably a good thing. Oh, that's dire resources. Okay. So navigation wise, where are we going? Okay. Right, I'm gonna remember what planets I've done, I'm gonna go to Sol, I'm gonna come back. Star map. Let's go, go, gadget. I mean, um, this system seems to be a pretty good one anyway. Um, it just doesn't have as much as it could. Ores, please be ores. I don't want to fight probes. Oh god. Right, I'm just gonna run away a little bit. Right. 
gaining on me. Oh my god, I'm such a bad pilot. My battery is charging um, very, very poorly. I need to be very careful. Oh god. 20 crew I lost in that. For 550 RU. Was it worth it? Probably not. That's one thing, I'm not a very good pilot, and I think that that's always important to establish. Now, the only time that I'm going to actively engage in combat is if I know it's a battle I can win. Um, I don't like fighting enemies that I can't win, and the problem with this game is it keeps throwing them at me, because just about until I get like the end game stuff and I can fire multiple uh, things which obliterate everything in one hit, um, I'm not going to be able to do very well against the enemy. Um, I really need those tracking modules, they're useful. Um, but then again, we're not doing too badly at the moment. And, um, you know, each, each weapon upgrades are pretty good. You know, so, you know, I'm not, I'm not unhappy with what I've got. It's just my inability to use it is, uh, it really shows. Right, so, go to Earth. I'm gonna ditch the things and head back. I think it's Beta Mense, or? Yeah, it's Beta Mense. Nothing really in the solar system at the moment. And I can re kit my stuff up. I hope the battle fares well, Captain. Oh, he just wanted to talk. That's good. Oh, look at all that. More fuel for the fire, eh, Captain? Right. Be careful, love. 19,000 U oh, you is good. <laughs> right. <laughs> right, so what I want is my modules. I want to get rid of two fuel tanks. I want to put high efficiency fuel systems in instead. So we've got two high efficiency fuels. Um, and I can replace that with another storage bay, I think. Might be good to do another dynamo unit. Yeah! Get that energy flowing. Um, get another planetary lander, just in case. Let's see how much fuel I can get with these advanced systems. I think it's about double what I could before. Um, I should... Last time I was able to get 160, this should go to 180, I think. No, it's more. Man, they're good. I'm really glad that I invested in those. Um. <laughs> yeah, uh, just about all of the upgrades um, I've got I can go. So, oh, I want to increase the crew. I do like this music. There's so much good music in this game. Everyone who worked on this game is amazing. Um, so, star map. We're going to head all the way out to Beta Mense again. And this time we've got a fully crewed ship. You know, fully fueled up, ready to go, solid. <laughs> Just checking, make sure I didn't get any um, messages or anything. Um, right. We are we are doing relatively well at the moment, so I'm just heading back to Beta Mense, and hopefully there's going to be some good resources there. Of course I'll let everyone know by the end of the video whether or not there were good resources in Beta Mense, but it's always important to um, sort of pass that information on. Um, just a secy. Right, there we go. Just sorting that one out. Keeps you a little bit busy. Um, I just had to let someone know something. 
I'm a composer for independent films, so um, if I can't do my job, etc., because I keep getting crashes, as I've had multiple crashes on this one, there are major problems from that. Right, so we are back to Beta Mense. I think one of the best things is it's like I could cut stuff out of this journey, but I want you to see exactly what I'm doing um, while I play. I'm not by no means good at this game. I'm like one of the worst players at this game. I have a thing where I can erase my memory and basically change basically change the way that my memory works. So one of my favorite films of all time is Alien, and I always, always, without a doubt, ooh, lots of mercury here. Is this 20 Mercury? Ah, oh, 16. Darn it. But I, I always like to rewatch Alien as though it's for the first time. And that's the best thing for me. Because Alien is my favourite film. And if I couldn't do that, I'd be so unhappy. Alright, so, you know, we've got some decent decent things here. Beta Mense. <gasps> Nothing here. Did I come to this one already? I don't think I did. It doesn't look familiar. Um, but, you know, sometimes there are going to be planets there you don't find resources. Oh, shiny. Alright, let's see if I can grab everything in one go. I want to get more um, things from the Mel Norme soon, so I'm going to head to a system where I know I can find them. Alright. Go. Oh snap! They kill my men. There we go. Pulling out. Doing well at the moment. Not too great, Beta Mense, if all is honest. Um, I really want more out of my um, star systems. I think I've got one or two planets left to go to. To this one. This one's nice and cold, so no real risk. High tectonics and weather. Ugh. This is not a. Beta Mense and Alpha Mense have been disappointing, to be honest. Considering the size of this system as well, I was really hoping that there'd be more stuff really gonna give me that little. If I lose one person on this planet, it's a waste of. such a waste of my journey. Because so, I've wasted the fuel as well. This is horrible. No, I wouldn't recommend coming to Beta Mense. <sighs> no real life, no nothing. But yeah, anyway. I suffer so you don't have to. <gasps> oh, we've got another planet. This one could have some good stuff. So maybe, maybe hold off on this. Um, Right, we got a pellucid world, nothing there. <laughs> I really don't like this system. I mean, yeah, it's nice having a system where you've got loads of stuff. But, like, loads of different planets, but when you're exploring them all and find nothing after nothing after nothing, it's so disappointing. I, I literally just, I really want to walk away from this system. Um, really? I'm starting to think the system wasn't properly built. Because usually, I mean, Fred, it's like Fred and, Fred and Paul wouldn't, wouldn't put me in this kind of predicament, uh, usually. Ah, uh, well, we've got some biological life. In this world, I think I can take it. Oh god. So there's literally nothing good here, um, from what I can see. Wow. This is dreadful. I know 
know I like data and everything, but this is really taking the cake. I mean, it's a weather of three, which means that my people are being killed. Um, there's literally nothing good here. These are just these take ages to kill. They do absolutely nothing. I mean, I'm getting half a stack of data. Yeah, that that is good, but it's not worth going to this system. The system is a failure. This is horrible. Um, it, it's not really impeding on my enjoyment of the game, but the game could have been better. I think I missed this purple world here. I really do. And this is where this is the best planet in the entire. What a system, what a massive system, and what's it got? Absolutely nothing. Well, that's me done for Beta Mense, um, don't go here, and I'll head to Gamma Mense, and hopefully that will be less of a disappointment. For some reason it's going autopiloting in the wrong direction. I'll see where I end up. Yeah, there was really nothing here. That's disappointing, but you know you got some. Some systems will be disappointing. This is this is the game. This is life. You know you can't always you can't always get a great star system. Um, and who knows? Maybe Gamma Mensae will make up for the both of them. Although I doubt it. Can't wait to head to Beetlejuice in a bit. All right, looks promising. Let's find out what happens next time. Bye. -bye.